because it's Marvel time. I've been waiting for this one. <laughs> I've, I've been waiting for this one. Mm-hmm. First of all, subscribe to the channel, download the podcast, check me out, check out Larry, like our videos, share them. It's Marvel time. So I'm just going to give y'all this to let you know what we about to talk about. Y'all will remember this. Previously on X-Men. We got a Marvel leak, fellas. We got a Marvel leak. And I can just tell you, I love her when she leaky. When she leaked like that, it makes me smile. Nah. Let, me, let, let me let y'all know what's going on with the Marvel leak. So first of all, it was leaked that we're going to get a storyline dealing with the X-Men in Marvel Phase 5 that stars the Savage Lands. If you don't know about the Savage Lands, in the comic books, it was a place in Antarctica that had dinosaurs and all kinds of prehistoric stuff. One of the main people in the Savage Land with this thing y'all looking at right here, his name is Sauron, alter ego, Dr. Carl Ligos. He had these humongous powers. He could hypnotize you. And if he touched you, he basically sucked your power, kind of, kind of the way that Rogue did, but he could not only suck the power from mutants, but he could suck them from human beings. And he also had this hypnotization power that he could do. And he went to school with Professor X. That's why his alter ego is Dr. Carl Ligos. Well, in this story, ladies and gentlemen, not only are we to see him as an adversary, but we're gonna see this guy right here, Mr. Sinister. And the way they're gonna try to weave in Mr. Sinister is kind of similar to what they did in the 90s comic books where he was splicing people's DNA. And what they're going to do with him and Sauron, they're going to have Sauron go to the Savage Lands. Mr. Sinister is going to manipulate his mind somehow, try to splice up his DNA, and his first splicing is going to be Sauron. In the comic book, Sauron got his power by being bitten by a mutant. But they're saying that they're going to do the storyline where Mr. Sinister is going to be up to those no good tricks of splicing DNA and his first person is going to be Sauron and that's going to spur the X-Men getting sucked into the Savage Lands. And man, when I say that was a good story, it was a hell of a story. Larry, I get this one to you. Are you excited to see Sinister and Sauron come to phase six MCU? Now, is this going to be, this is going to be the actual, uh, this is going to be the live action or this is going to be the animated series? Oh, no, 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 no. This is going to be the MCU. Marvel live oh, action. Is- All right. Yeah, man. Yeah, that sounds dope then. <laughs> boy, when I got that leak, boy, I was wet. It looked like I had got out of a man. pool. I was wet. <laughs> T Street. <laughs> they better they better really start producing all this stuff. They're they're talking, they're gonna be up at leaking up to Marvel, you know, MCU space 20 in a minute. Yeah. They better start putting out this stuff. <laughs> yeah. I'm 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 excited. To, I'm I'm excited to see that. I think that would be a good a good fresh approach to the X-Men. As you know, give them something really nice and challenging to uh to work with and you know and revitalize that that storyline um dang i that that's a it was is the leak reliable it's it's someone who worked within the studios yeah Yeah. now now mind you i've been following these rumors and these leaks for years and i would say from all the rumors and leaks that i hear 
75% of them tend to be true or have some truth in it. Mm. So now you're talking about two main adversaries of the X-Men. And when you start putting the clues together, Kevin Feige already said in his top five favorite animated shows ever, X-Men was one of them. The 90s X-Men was one of them. Right. That was it's a good all, show. It was, man, it was a very good, that and Spider-Man from yeah. the 90s were two great shows. Right. And we yeah. know Kevin Feige, whenever he says he likes something, he draws inspiration from it. And people have been wanting to see Sinister. I can see Sinister in the MCU. And he's not like your cosmic level villain. So you're not going to need to go and get another team to help out the X-Men to defeat him. But he is Sinister. And Sir Ron and his powers are pretty deadly too. Because if right. he touches you, he absorbs your energy. And then he hmm. can he can he can hypnotize you. One of his other powers was he can get in your face, hypnotize you, get your energy, and have you do his bidding. Right. Um bruh, I'm there. Yeah. <laughs> I'm, I'm there. So I'm so what's so what's Fave Six? 2027? <laughs> Shit, man. <laughs> Something like that. <laughs> it's probably I like mean, phase I, I'll be 2025. Honest, like, I hear about this stuff. I hear about this stuff, and it's, and it's cool to see, and it's sort of exciting to hear about. But then it's so far off. You're just like, <laughs> that's, man, that's good, that's good well, because we'll, we'll be them for we'll be them forgot it, and then they'll drop it again, and then we'll be able to get really yeah. excited about seeing it again. <laughs> so they're talking yeah. about phase five movies. Phase five movies are starting in 2023. Yeah. So 20, 2024 is when you see phase six. So, I, you know, I, I find these Marvel stories every day and I'll keep bringing them to you guys every single day. Oh, 